Hello guys, welcome to another video of Additional Mathematics. In these video sets, we are going to solve questions from your textbook one by one. If you do not want to miss our videos, please do subscribe to our channel right now. Let's start today's question. Okay, what is given in the question? Find the modulus and amplitude of this question or also we have to express this in a polar form. Okay, so what is given? Uh, this is the value of what is given as z. So we need to compare this with what? x plus i y. So I have to compare this to this, this to this. So what will be the value of x? x value will be 1. What will be the value of y? y value will be equal to minus root 3. And what is an r? r is the root of x square plus y square. So r that is amplitude that is nothing but 1 square plus minus root 3 whole square that is nothing but 2. You can put this in calculator, so we will get it as 2. Modulus is done. Next is amplitude. To know amplitude, we have to draw or we have to know on which quadrant this thing exists. x positive, y negative, again it is in the fourth quadrant. In the fourth quadrant, amplitude, AMP, amplitude is nothing but 2 pi minus alpha. But what is an alpha? Alpha is denoted or represented as or the formula for alpha is the tan inverse of mod y upon mod x. Mod means we have to take only y value, not with the symbol, without the symbol. So tan inverse of what is the y value? Root 3 divided by 1. Tan inverse of root 3 is how much? Tan inverse of root 3 is how much? 60 degree. It is nothing but pi over 3. So amplitude is nothing but we can also call it as theta is nothing but 2 pi minus pi over 3. So how much will I get? 3 into 2 is 6. So I will get 5 pi upon 3. What is a polar form? Z is equal to r into cos theta plus i sin theta. This is the formula for polar. So z is equal to what is an r? r value is 2 cos Theta value is how much? 5 pi upon 3 plus i sin. Again, theta value is what? 5 pi upon 3. Is that okay? This is the polar form for the given question. Okay? Here, how did we end up here? In these questions, we are only solving questions from your textbook. If you want to really know what the procedures and all, you can go to our course, check. The link is in the description. Okay? Sure. Watch our entire additional mathematics video course, which includes all the prerequisites, all the basics that is enough for your exams, and also will take you from the scratch to advanced level. And also we will clear all your doubts with a live interactive one-on-one -on -one sessions. You can see all this and the sample of our video course in the description. And if you are not subscribed to our channel, please do subscribe for more videos like this one. Thanks for watching. All the best.